Hello friends, I am Dr. Bhushan Joshi. I am consultant neurologist practicing at Manipal Hospital, Kharadi. This is our uh, attempt to create awareness regarding a common condition called as Alzheimer disease. Alzheimer disease is most common type of dementia. Dementia are a group of diseases where patients tend to lose their higher cognitive functions. Higher cognitive functions include memory, which is most common, public is aware about that. But apart from memory, other functions like calculation, geographical orientation, then logical thinking, reasoning, all those abilities are also lost. Overall, there is change in personality of the patient who is suffering with this disease. This disease is categorized as a degenerate, neurodegenerative disease, meaning some neurons, that is cells of the brain starts dying faster than their natural uh, rate of decay. <clears throat> As a result, brain start losing its abilities to perform certain set of functions, starting with memory and then, as I mentioned, calculation and geographical orientation, all these functions are gradually lost in this set of diseases. So, when patients develop these uh, symptoms, the onset is usually slow and it is slowly progressive. And these diseases are usually more common after 60 years of age. So, there is confusion inside family or patient, with patient that whether it is age related change or it is really onset of dementia. When this patient present to us with the similar symptoms, then certain set of investigations are conducted, which includes MRI brain, some blood tests which are like vitamin B12 level, thyroid function test. This test helps us to diagnose this condition, to find out any uh, parallel processes which are potentially reversible, which are affecting patient's memory. Once we decide this is the uh, Alzheimer disease uh, or dementia, uh, then the treatment part starts. Unfortunately, as I said, it's a degenerative and progressive condition. Medications are very limited and uh, the purpose of medicine is to slightly slow down the progress. There is nothing to stop this or reverse this condition. So apart from medication, we focus on lifestyle modifications. Uh, we encourage patients to do physical exercises, at least 20-30 minutes of vigorous exercises two to three times in a week. Then we encourage patients to do some mental exercises like solving crossword puzzles, sudoku puzzles, learning new things, musical instruments or uh, singing song, drawing, painting. This type of mental activities try and, um, and we encourage patients to do those. By doing these mental activities, we create new neuronal connections which helps us to slow down the progress of dementia. And the last part of treatment of dementia is actually counseling of the family member. I think dementia is a disease of entire family, not one individual patient. As we are living our life with the same individual, uh, after disease his character personality changes. So coping up with his new character is sometimes emotionally challenging for family members. Certain uh, type of natural behavioral reactions are to be changed with uh, these uh, dementia patients. So these counseling sessions and training of family member regarding how to take care of uh, your dementia patient is most important part and most fruitful part of the treatment. I hope this information is useful and will help you to take care of your dementia patient uh, with more accuracy. Thank you.